detainee was told, this is no longer the call to prayer. You are not allowed to pray. This is a call to interrogation, so pay attention. While living in Bosnia, the detainee associated with a known Al-Qaeda operative. Give me his name. I do not know. How can I respond to this? Did you know of anybody that was a member of Al-Qaeda? No, no. No? No. I asked the interrogators to tell me who this person was. Then I could tell you if I might have known this person, but not if the person is a terrorist. I did not do these things, but I do not have anything to prove this. They want answers which you can't give them because you, you have no involvement in anything. That kind of mental torture is a hundredfold worse than physical torture. The US policy of extraordinary rendition has a human face and it is mine. They stripped us down uh, naked um, and they tied our hands behind our back. Our sack was put over our head. I still do not know why this happened to me. I have been told that the American Secretary of State, Condoleezza Rice, confirmed in a meeting with the German Chancellor that my case was a mistake. An Iraqi national died cause of death, blunt force injuries complicated by compromised respiration, manner of death, homicide. Prisoner 421, they dragged him away uh, and beat him some more and eventually he was killed. The facial slap and walling contain precautions to ensure that no pain even approaching severe pain results. I was smashed into the wall and repeatedly slapped in the face by the same two interrogators as before. We don't torture people. Let me say that again to you. We don't torture people. The whole procedure was repeated The waterboard, times. which inflicts no pain or actual harm whatsoever, does not, in our view, inflict severe pain or suffering. On each occasion, I was suffocated once or twice. They, they do water, where you suffocate, they put lots of water until you scream. We were released without any charges, without anything, no apologies, nothing. 